today's video, I want to look at the difference between inserting slides from an outline or reusing slides. This is a concept that my students seem to struggle with as they prepare for the PowerPoint 2016 exam. Let's look at inserting from outline first. I have a Word document open and we're going to bring this into PowerPoint. I want you to look at the formatting for this real quick before we bring this into PowerPoint. If you look here, first has heading one. This number one has heading two as well as two. And then A, B, and C have heading three. And these others have the same formatting. It's just not tabbed over so that you can quickly see it. And then at the very end of my document, I have a few bullet points. I have the word first as a first level bullet. And then I have one and two as a second level bullet. I'm showing you all of this because as I bring this in, I think you're going to be a little bit surprised at how PowerPoint brings this information into the presentation. So I'm going to go back to my PowerPoint presentation. I only have one slide here, but something to note, whether it's inserting slides from outline or you're reusing slides, PowerPoint's always going to bring in that information after the slide that you have selected. So we're on the home tab. We're in the slides group. I'm going to click the new slide drop down. And I'm going to select slides from outline. And the file that we want is this outline file. Some other types of formatting besides a Word document that you could use is an RTF file and also a text file. And the extensions for those files would be .rtf and .txt. So it doesn't have to be a Word document to do this. Let's go ahead and click insert. Let's look at this first slide. Notice that the word first is missing from the presentation. PowerPoint interprets the heading one style as create a new slide. So each one of these headings has a heading one style. And so what PowerPoint did was just add a new slide when it saw those headings. And so my heading two was the first level bullet and my heading threes were second level bullets. Let me scroll back down to slide five. Remember those bullet points I had at the end of that document? You can see what it did was it brought that in as a new slide. And even though I had a second level for points one and two, they were just brought in as a brand new slide. Let's go ahead and look back at that so you can see it. See, this word first was a first level, and then one and two were both second level bullets. And so that's bringing in from outline. Now let's look at reusing slides. I'm gonna scroll back up. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my cursor on slide two before I bring in these slides so you can see that it's gonna be put after the slide. I'm gonna go to new slide. And I'm going to select reuse slides. And on the right hand side, we're going to click browse and click browse file. The file that we want is the additional slides. Now the word file that I had brought in previously was saved to this folder and notice it doesn't show. And when we inserted the word file to do from outline, the PowerPoint slides weren't there. On the certification exam, you should note that if the file that you're looking for isn't there, you probably did the wrong one and you just want to move to the other one. So let's go ahead and click open. This presentation has five slides and we can see those slides on the right hand side. To insert a slide, all I have to do is just click on this once and notice that slide was brought in. If you look carefully, you can see that the design of these two slides are different. This one has the white on the right. And this one doesn't. Maybe when you clicked on that slide, you didn't want the design of the slide to change. If you click keep source formatting and then you click on this, notice that it kept the original formatting. And again, as I click, it's being placed underneath the slide that I had selected. And so maybe we want third and fifth, and that's all we want to bring in. When we're done, all we have to do is click close. And that's bringing in slides from outline and reusing slides.